to encourage people just to be the change they want to see in their lives. Be the change they want to see in the world. Be the change they want to see in their families, in their, in their relationships, in their community, in their workplaces. Go out and be it. I think the thing about the book, why I finally wanted to get there and write it, is just to provide hope. I think many people maybe look at me now or look at other people that, that have been successful and say, wow, they had it so nice. That's not the case. The second piece about it is I want people to know their own story and be okay with it. You know? And then answer the so what. Many of us have had stories of being a victim, whether it being beat up or tormented or put down or told you're not good enough or not being able to hang around with the right crowd all of us have though an innate story of victory of who we are we don't understand it but the book is there to provide hope to people and it's simple you know it's my story a lot of my story is in that book to provide people with hope and inspiration that they can change their own lives. And I believe they can. We all believe they can. It's hard sometimes because we want to hold on to those stories. For some odd reason, we want to hold on to that story. Because when somebody comes along that looks like that past story, we want to be able to get angry or mad or shut down. You know, we don't want to grow sometimes. And a lot of us struggle not so much with what we're weak at, I think what a lot of us struggle at, especially as young adults getting into adulthood is we realize our greatness, we just don't know what to do with it. And how do you get that out of the box? How do I take my story and make it one that was in the past, one of a victim, of a chump, to go to a place where I can make that story one of a victor or a champion. That's what I'm hoping to get out of the book, that people read it and they become inspired to just do something different. Be the change you want to see in the world rather than complain about it all day long. Do something about it. If you want a better relationship with your spouse, then go have that better relationship. If you want a better relationship with your kids, then go have that relationship. If you want a better job, then go get that better job. There's nothing holding you back. What are those fears that I have? And dealing with them, going into them. Okay, because like we what we like to say, if you don't get into them, you can't get out of them. You become trapped. You become trapped in your story again and again and again. And most people aren't even living in the present. They're living out of stories they created 10, 15, 20, sometimes 40 or 50 years ago which is sad, okay? But there's hope, and that's what I hope they get out of the book. Reach out, we're here for you. It's simpler and easier than you think. Get centered, get connected, get it done.